Russ Hess here, RussHess.com, Open Talk with Russ Hess. Hey, I just wanted to talk to you a little bit about becoming greater at what you're doing. You know, you've got it down, you've got it figured out how you're going to make that next move and what you're doing. You know, you've got uh, a plan in place, you've got, uh, you know, whatever it is, a uh, weight loss program, uh, education, um, whatever it may be. But you wanting to become greater in that. You're wanting to excel and become perhaps even the best at something. Well, it's going to take a little bit of effort in order to get that two millimeter difference and change to make you the greatest. want to go from good to great and the answer to getting there is in your own actions in your own efforts what are you doing to gain momentum what are you doing to spin that wheel a little bit harder a little bit farther what are you willing to do and the answer better be you're willing to get into the right team you're willing to get the right people playing on the right team with you not only do you need to get the right team, but you need to get a team that is passionate towards the goal, passionate towards seeing you go from good to great. You know, it's not always easy to pick the right people, and it's also not always easy to manage or lead those folks. So they have to have a master plan. There has to be something that they can buy into. Listen, who would ever suspect that you're capable of doing some great things? But yet you are. It's all within your head. It's 100% within your head. You are capable of being a great person. Great at what the thing you know greatness doesn't just start by being good greatness starts within your mind by wanting to become great and it's not for notoriety it's because you know that you can do it there's a two millimeter shift that allows you to make a step every day towards that greatness a step in the right direction a step towards greatness. You know, some of the greatest people in the world didn't get there overnight. They spent 10 years moving one brick at a time, taking one step at a time, making one dollar at a time. Whatever it is, they did it one step at a time. You can do the same. You know, Anthony Robbins says, success often leaves footprints, and it's true. So start taking a look at people that have been successful, that are successful, that have done the things that you're wanting to do. You know, find those people, you model what they do, put into action things that they do. You know, work on your thought processes the same way they would. You know, Hopefully you choose noble and honoring people and not evil people because your actions will dictate where it is that you're going to go. So uh, let me sit down here and talk to these folks and see what their uh, thoughts are. Um, oh, wait a second. Mortified. Oh my gosh! So what am I doing to go from good to great? And the answer to that is, is I'm going to inspect everything it is that I want to improve on. I'm going to take all those aspects of my life that I know that I need to make improvements on. I'm going to document them. I'm going to discern where my weaknesses are with those. And I am going to get the right people on board, the right folks to give me good counsel to get me where I want to go. 
and I'm going to work hard towards making sure that I get there. It's not going to be easy. There's a lot of aspects of things that I need to improve on, things that I personally need to do for my own health, for my own mindset, for my own finances, for my family. There's just a lot of aspects that I need to work on. And I think it's completely doable. But if I sit around and do absolutely nothing, then nothing will happen. That Easter egg will not open up and will not present itself with a prize. So I'm going to get out there. I'm going to get after it. I'm going to make it happen. And so can you. So you want to go from good to great? Let me get a little key advice. Stay entirely passionate about what it is that you're wanting to go for. You know, answer that question, that all-encompassing question. Why? Why do you want to do this? Why do you want to be great? You, know, you answer those questions, you're going to be able to propel yourself into doing all the discipline that it takes to get there. You know, the momentum, so to speak, building up that momentum, spinning that wheel, spinning that ball, putting together the plan of action that you need to do in order to get where you need to go, putting together the right team, building that team, and building the momentum with that team. Is it going to happen overnight? No. It may take a while. You may have to work really hard and really strong to get where it is you want to go. But in the end, you're going to get there and you're going to notice that that momentum is going to spin itself. And what you thought was a lot of work is now working for you. With that said, this is Russ Hess, Russ Hess.com, Open Talk. We'll see you on the next video.